Let's go live out there into Tel Aviv to I-24 News correspondent Daniel Ziri. Roma is actually a, a guide here, a tour guide here at the um, Ben Gurion's house in Tel Aviv, and uh, he's going to give us a little tour. That's right. That's right. Let's have a tour. Uh, actually, this house is an open house uh, for the last 40 years, seven days a week, and this house was built in the 1930s by the Ben Gurion family. Actually, you can see their pictures over here: uh, David, Paula, his wife, and also the children of the Ben Gurion family. Ula, Amos, and Renana. Let's go a little bit closer to it so you guys can see a little better. Yeah. Yes, please. So the interesting thing is that Ben Gurion dedicated the house to the state of Israel, and the state of Israel made it into an open house, uh, less than a museum. So we can really get a feeling of a real home here at the Ben Gurion house. Um, so you can see the authentic furniture of the Ben Gurion family, and even people go crazy about the colored floor tiles, a symbol of old houses in Tel Aviv. Right, a lot of these old buildings do have those uh, colorful tiles. What else can you tell us about this living room? Um, well, this is kind of the more authentic size of the house because it used to be smaller in the 1930s. Actually, Ben Gurion worked very hard to take a mortgage and start building this house for his family, for the kids and the wife. And we can see that the house expanded along the years. So let's go see the expansion. Okay, let's go see. Wh which uh, room are you taking us to now? Well, let's go into the kitchen, which we must say was majorly Paula's kitchen. Ben Gurion was not a chef. <laughs> so let's go into All right, we're going into the kitchen. Yes. Guys. Brilliant. It's Ben Gurion's kitchen. Here you can see the authentic pieces used by Paula to make Ben Gurion breakfast every morning. Actually, she was very concerned with his health, and every morning she went into the kitchen and made a special dish called kuchmuch, which is a kind of yogurt mixed with raspberry syrup, and it doesn't taste very well. Uh, well, at least Ben Gurion didn't like it, but because Paula made it, he ate it all together. Yeah, well, I bet you want to try that. <laughs> yeah, I want to say that, you know, the Okay, so the people that come here can really get a close contact. Hold on, yes. Yeah. No, 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 please, please. People who come in here, let the man speak. I'm in love. Yeah. All right, all right. Tom, go ahead. Uh, so uh, people that come here can really get a close uh, personal intimate meeting with the uh, style of the 1970s, uh, kind of the later period that Ben Gurion used the house. So they walk into the kitchen and they say, oh, my grandmother actually has a fridge just like that. So this is really interesting to see how people react. 